Representative Scott, there's, there are service or fee incentives that really are the fundamental base of this problem. If you consider a situation, suppose a, suppose a lender or a servicer is considering a short sale today versus carrying that property to a foreclosure six months from now. If, that's that, if the servicer approves a short sale today, its fee revenue for servicing that loan stops today. If they keep that in their books for six months, they earn fees for property inspection, broker opinions of value, forced place insurance, and all of the other fees that continue to accrue over until that house is finally sold at foreclosure. When it sells at foreclosure for perhaps 50% of what the short sale price would have been, the, suff the servicer suffers no consequence because it doesn't own the loan. The investor suffers the consequence. So the servicer incentives are to block short sales and to keep the property earning a fee revenue for them.